propped up. The three of us have been friends for so long. It's hard to believe what God has done in our lives. A lot of my friends and I grew up in an unstable home. Our dads were either absent, abusive, or disconnected. There was a lot of alcohol and violence. In high school, I was the youngest guy in my group of friends. We smoked weed, drank, and got into a lot of stupidity. When I was a senior, all of my friends graduated and left, so I was pretty broken. My sociology class was talking about religion, and I got really curious about it. I started to watch sermons on YouTube and heard the gospel clearly. I was torn because my old friends kept coming back into town and we would party. I told my mom that I wanted to follow God, but it was hard for me to leave my friends behind. She told me, if you don't leave, then none of you will be saved. I came to realize that Jesus died for me and I asked God to be my savior. I felt brand new, but I had no idea what to do. So I would go to school really early and I saw an old drug buddy and told him I was following Jesus now. Turns out he was too. And he invited me to CFC where I met Pastor De Silva. This was early 2012. Andrew was already at college in Orlando and I started to reach out to him. I would send him gospel videos to watch and we saw each other when he would come back home. I didn't realize how God was working in him. He gave his life to Jesus, but it was hard for him to start a new life up there. So he moved back to West Palm Beach in the summer of 2012 and started coming to CFC with me. Andrew's older brother, Jose, had gotten deeper into drugs and crime than we ever had. He was dating one of my cousins at the time, so Andrew and I reached out to him. He was really scared to come to church. It took a lot of inviting. The first time he came, he was sweating so much. I'm pretty sure it was because he was on drugs. But he was drawn to it. He was drawn to the message and the truth that was being spoken. After he and my cousin broke up, it all came together for him and he surrendered his life to Jesus. Pastor De Silva and the people at CFC really opened their hearts to us and loved us like family. We all started volunteering in student ministry and when CFC joined up with Family Church, we got new opportunities to grow and be trained as leaders. We all interned in student ministry and now Jose is in the residency. I'm the student minister at Family Church Village Andrew leads high school ministry at Family Church downtown, and Jose is the student minister at Family Church Jupiter. When I think about how we grew up and how we were running the streets, I look at our lives now, and I'm just amazed by the power of the gospel. I'm so grateful to God and how he has let us serve him here at Family Church. Jesus has really changed us. 